There's definitely a stereotype that gay people are sissies or wimps or pansies, but I don't think that could be further from the truth. In fact, over the weekend, I posted a coming out story from a young man named Tobias, and at age 12, he was kicked out of his family's home because he came out, and a year later, at age 13, he was found by one of his teachers living homeless underneath a bridge. And yet, despite all of that, he still managed to graduate high school a year early. And when you look at Tobias, he might come across as very sensitive or a little bit flamboyant, and but don't for a second mistake any of that for weakness because that young man has more strength than most people will ever know. And so while the stereotype is that gay people are wimps or pansies, I mean, I think the reality is that gay people are some of the strongest, most courageous people that you'll ever meet. Because it does take a lot of courage to come out to your family, to risk being disowned, to risk losing your friends, or to swim upstream against the current of society that tells you that who you love is wrong. Being gay is definitely not for sissies. In fact, it takes a lot of courage. So I'm gonna post Tobias' story so you can check it out. I think it's particularly important for straight people to see this story because I think it puts everything into perspective. So if you agree with me, if you think it takes a lot of courage to be gay, well then let me know. And if you disagree with me, then shut your mouth. No, I'm just kidding. You can let me know that too. So I love you guys. I'll talk to you soon. Peace out.